and hope the game isn't loud. Tell me why is a story-based game that takes your choices into account to shape your relationships with other characters. Choose wisely. Xbox Game Studios. My brain is never doing. If this is very loud, I apologize, chat. I tried to adjust it before this, but... Oh, this might be loud. I hope it's not loud. It's not? Okay. Well, I suppose nothing has quite happened yet, so we'll see. Hey, kiddo. I need to ask you a few questions, okay? Okay. I may or may not be able to answer them. Can you tell me what happened? Tonight? Oh god, more cops? God damn it. I I went to show her my haircut. She had a gun. She uh, Take your time. Uh 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 She freaked out. She must love their cops. I mean, the cops are like bad okay. they are assholes in Life no, is Strange too, so I can assure you that's it's not, not the case. Okay. Oh god. My mom tried okay. to kill me, so Oh yeah, that's not good. That's not good. So I stabbed her. Okay. I killed my mother. Okay. This is how we start. Okay. All right. How was that chat? Was that was that it, it felt loud in my ears, so I feel like it's loud in y'all's ears. I could probably turn it down like a smidge. A, a little a little bit. Audio's fine. You sure? Not loud, I have everything up, it's not loud. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see once we have music kicked in here. Alrighty. It's on the low side of good? Huh, maybe I'm just fucking crazy. So, we are off to a very, um, interesting start. Oh, this game is... This feels weird playing in, like, 60 FPS. You got a dub? Fuck yeah, Milk. Proud of you. Brush them teeth. I'm glad I'm not the only one who walks around while brushing their teeth. Are y'all sure this isn't loud? Because this is, like, loud in my ears. I don't have the bot on. Fuck you. I mean, if it's not loud for y'all, I'm not gonna worry about it. Oh, you really is fine. Okay. I'll believe y'all. I'll roll for this. I'm just so used to having, like, the shit turned down a lot for y'all, so... I'm digging this music. We're already off to a good start. Oh, that's adorable. Turn down for what? To do. Yeah, hey, where's your keys? Damn it, Bobby. Send your house. Oh god. Oh. Okay, first, I'm gonna find the keys to the old house. Oh wow, okay. Then, I, I... I'm gonna drive to Fireweed and I'm not going to freak out. Okay, Everything's so fine. I, 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 tur I turned the camera sensitivity up all the way. I need to turn that down. That's gonna that's gonna make people motion sick. Okay, that's a little that's better. Okay. Actually, that's still pretty fast, Sean. See here. <laughs> Might be a bit much. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, come on. Oh, do we not like this? Why do I still have this? 
Every time I look at it, it reminds me of how very single I am. Oh, sick. Fuck yes, reading options. Oh, love this. Alright, up to a great start. Time and I against any two. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, game, just throw it all at me. Police Chief Brown has counsel to reconsider budget. Doc strike to begin this week. Mayoral election candidate Tom Vecchi supports gun control. Money for local schools. I can't believe we're going to go back to that house. <sighs> At least I'll have Tyler. Shit, I didn't... No, no, go back in. Back in. 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 Go, go back. I accidentally pressed B too much. What do we got? I should probably check my email one more time before I go. Well, should. I've already done that three times this morning. Oh, okay, never mind. Alright, no comment. <laughs> Michael and Tyler are so gonna hit it off. Hell yeah. <clears throat> okay. Sweet, these are cute. Oh, that's the child picture. It's gonna be so crazy to see him after all these years. Hell yeah. Is he gonna like this? You're goddamn Great right he much. is. It's a duck strike. I wish. Alright, let's look at our list. Itinerary, snacks and drinks, car keys, house keys. Remember also, the house keys. I think. No, get the house keys. Still need to find those damn house keys. Oh, okay. Okay. That's cute. What do we got here? I should probably get rid of this. I mean, I can stream it anytime I want. But it makes me happy just to look at the box. Hell yeah. Journey Through the Stars, which is of Eldham, Season 1 and 2. Sweet. I need to bring this with me to Juno. Yeah, you do. How goes movie? Shut the fuck up, Milk. I have got to make solid plans to see the Geminids. The Geminids. Go. Night Watch, Alaska, by Arnold Thierry. Hey, you wanna freeze your ass off watching burning rocks fall through the sky? Oh, yeah, sick! I might need to work on my sales pitch. Not I don't even here. need to be in a thing. What? Not here. Oh, all right. I'm looking for keys. Oh. Ooh, I can't wait to force Tyler to watch this with me. He's oh, no. totally gonna hate it. Oh no! Oh no! You evil bitch! Why would it be in here? I don't know. You tell me. You looked in here. What do you want from me? I didn't even realize that was a closet. I was just clicking on shit. One more season. What am I even going to do with myself when it's over? Get invested in the lives of real people? Oh, right. I stashed them down here. I hope you did. It's going to be hell awkward if you open it and it's not in there. So that's where you've been hiding. <laughs> that's essentially what it did. This it was... feels like another lifetime. I should clean up too. I didn't get a chance to clean up today. I was too busy falling. Alright. I think I'm ready to go now. Probably not going to see any stars at this time of day. You don't know that, fucking coward. I could look at this artwork all day. Not the prettiest of my creations, but she weirdly kind of looks like me in the morning. I see that eye. You can't fucking fool me. I see that eye. Hold on, I gotta check it off the list. Check it off your list. Check it off. Check, check it. God damn it. Alright. I think I'm ready to go now. Do we have working mirrors? Yeah, we do. Hell yeah. What do we got? I haven't practiced since oh. high school. Yeah, we do have a reflection. Uh, Ellie. She's gonna be so awkward. What? Dear Tyler, I know what you're thinking. A letter? Why all weird and formal? What's wrong with email? 
Well, I figured, hey bro, just wanted to give my twin a shout before reuniting after 10 years of swank juvie is more like letter territory. Whatever, you'll thank me when we're 90 and the machines have taken over and you still have something to read by candlelight. See? Always thinking ahead. Anyway, I can't believe you'll be out for real in a few weeks. What? Amazing! I'm definitely going to be tr going to be awkward when I see you, so please try not to notice, okay? How's your last month going? Are you sad about leaving your mentees? I bet they're going to miss you. I got my tires replaced, so I'm all good to pick you up. And you could save the snap. You could save the snark when you see my ride. She's been through a lot, and we can't all be car guys. Anyways, anyway, the vet she's let me take the day off so we can go straight to the old house and get it ready for the sale and everything. Can't wait to never think about that place again. I really can't wait to see you. I don't know if I made that clear. Love you, Allison. Aw. That was adorable. Oh, Sonny. I can't believe I'm about to leave this room for the last time. Okay. I'm pretty much done here. I just need to grab my goblin, and I'm off. Aw. Uh, gonna miss these dum-dums. Aw. Uh, Aw. Uh, it's cute. What do we got here? Oh, hell yeah. I know most of these by heart at this point. Hell yeah. I wish I could have finished this before I left, but god, it was a slog. Yeah, no, not no yawning yet. What am I, a nerd? Hey, little guy, you're gonna be reunited with your sister soon. Fuck yeah. Can I ride you a fin? Yeah, I get that. Oh, cool. I guess I'm totally ready to go now. Bye, Herbert. 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 Hi, huh. Herbert. Oh my god. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. You stay here. Educate the youngsters in classic cinema. Hell yeah. Did not. I need to get my application ready for next summer. Uh. What else could we do here? What's this? What's this? Take me. This box of junk treasures is now yours by the first law of finders keepers. Sick. I want to look in it, but I guess I don't get that option. What is today? Today, November 2nd, then? I think? Some fireweed. Is this the letter that I just wrote, or is this different? Hey, Aaron, you know I'm bad at this, but just wanted to say you've been the best counselor and at risk yet redeemable youth. Haha, ha, could want. Thanks for putting up with me and helping in more ways than you know. I'll try to make it count outside fireweed. Survival is rebellion. Thanks, man. Tyler. Aw. It's cute as shit. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright. Anything else we can play around with? No? Okay. Wait, is that just the thing, or are those different? Oh, those are different. What do we got? Bob died to leave this behind, but the old house would probably collapse if I blasted this inside. Man, the soundtrack to my angsty teen years. I'll leave it for the next rebel. They've been listening Damn. to this on a loop lately. Damn. The drowning booster? Yeah, that's fucking metal as shit. Man, he's going places. And I'll be able to say I helped him on his way. Tyler and I had 20 matches, young Tling... Tlingit? Tlingit, I think is how you say that? I don't know. Hmm. Is there any way I can... Should I gotta do no, tutoring? That's Help Perez with college. Now. Okay. I'm kinda of bummed that the UI doesn't really have its own identity, so to speak. Well, I mean... Life is Strange has always been pretty simplistic. <laughs> Thank you, closed captions. It was a hollow rep.
I wanted that, though. <laughs> I wanted that bear, though. That was cute as shit. God damn it. Hi, Tyler. Hi. First time we see each other in ten years, and it's hi, Tyler. Oh. Sorry, I... It's fine, Allison. Hi, hey, Tyler, you just... To start. What? <laughs> why, did you, why did you fucking confront her on it? What the fuck? <laughs> Likewise. Pretty bad boy. You're not wrong. You have anything else <laughs> you to forget? No, nope. this is it. <laughs> My last ten years in a bed. <laughs> then we should get going. <laughs> Dare you say hi. Fairy. You know what? I'm glad you threw out the bird. Thanks. Tyler doesn't fucking deserve it. it. It's really good. Yeah, he's so. Maybe, you know what? You're right. Maybe you just want to. I got a couple first. of local coffee shops to hang his art. Tyler Ronan, shaping the leaders of tomorrow. Yep, we're screwed. <laughs> so, are you gonna miss anything about this place? I mean, apparently, I really like the people here. Honestly people the other residents my mentees my counselor Aaron it took me a while to fit in but once I did I felt like <laughs> you shall only trust me with a white they captain. made me feel safe safe enough to be me that's so great I'm really happy for you hell yeah we planning to drive to Delos Crossing or push you are welcome to walk nah I'll take my chances Need one last look or anything? Looked. Let's go. This is cute so far. I like this. Six months of beautiful of seeing the whole time. No, it doesn't doesn't flow the same as SpongeBob. No, really, I am one hundred percent not creative enough to make that stuff up. Oh, and just last week they had to turn the ferry around because a bear was on board. No way. Someone heard a commotion in the back of a delivery truck, so they opened it up, and there was the bear, fat and happy on a literal mountain of empty chip bags. <laughs> you go where the food is. Oh. I can relate to that. So then what happened? I'm not sure. I think they couldn't get him to leave, so they tranked him. Damn. Oh, poor buddy. Shot in the ass just for getting the munchies. Yeah, well, you know what they say. Safety first in bear country. Yeah, but prevention is best. Common sense goes a long way in keeping them from getting shot. The bear is fine, Tyler. For now. You hear they've been talking about loosening up regulations on trophy hunting again? Higher bag limits, inhumane ground traps, even bringing back hibernation hunting. Jesus. What kind of asshole gets off on killing a sleeping animal? I'm not against hunting, but predators play a vital role in the health of our natural parks. What? Why are you smiling? I'm being serious. Oh, I can tell, Ranger Tyler. Not yet. But at least I got the school part out of the way. <sighs> I can't believe you got a bachelor's already. Damn. I host a half-completed certificate in accounting from an online college that may have stolen my credit card number. You'll figure out what you want. You have time. Oh yeah, I'm definitely on Tyler's How side. How are you feeling? Like, I'm about to drive straight into a whiteout, and my fog lights are dead. I mean, the fog lights ain't gonna do shit. Regardless. <laughs> you mean fish did. What about you? Oh, I can move the camera. Well, zoned out there for a second. Sorry. What's up? I'm sorry, I just... Trying to wrap my head around the fact that you're right here, standing beside me, on our way to Delos. You don't have to apologize. It's a lot. Why did we take the ferry instead of the coast road? 
Because I didn't want to be stuck in the car with you for an extra two hours. Ha ha. <laughs> Got him. We have to take the ferry. Press it's the only way to reach Delos from Fireweed. I see. Well, good. I don't think my stomach could have taken two more hours of how you handle curves. I'm sorry. Do you want to take over driving when we dock? <laughs> no. You're going to have to get back behind that wheel at some point, you know. Look, I put a Fireweed van nose first in a ditch. Hey, at least you missed the porcupine. It's true. I guess. I'm guessing things haven't changed much. You mean in Delos? Still the capital of East Jesus nowhere. Can't wait to get out of here. Oh. Was it really that bad? Pretty much. But it could definitely have been worse. Like if you'd been tucked away in a center for troubled youth? Right. At least you had Michael. Yeah. I don't think I'd have survived high school without him. Bet you're gonna miss him when you move to Juno. How's he doing? Good. Good, good. Uh, but I haven't seen him much outside of work lately. He's been busy with his dance and helping his clan organize a potlatch. Is that smoke coming out of Stonehouse? That one over there? No, the one just beyond it. You know, the one the elders say is haunted, is spooky. I suppose with this one, the uh, smoke coming right. out of it? Oh, a whole group of us were drinking at a bonfire down at the point and got dared to go inside. We didn't make it past the garden. <laughs> Sounds fun. Uh, it was. Um. So, True. we're really going back there, huh? To Stonehouse? I mean, we're going home. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Think the house will sell? No interested buyers yet. Turns out, people don't line up to buy murder houses with no electricity. Sick. At least it's got one hell of a view. Unlike Juno. Hey, Juno has mountain views aplenty. It just also has people and fun. Damn. You still thinking you might be my roomie? Thinking about it. Hey, can I ask you That's a question? That's a safe bet. Shoot. I was told... I'm... Um, I mean, after you, well, graduated, I guess, and became a mentor three years ago, you still basically spent all your time at Fireweed, right? Pretty much. There were a few times I tried to go to these meetups for trans people in Juno, but... I was going to say, this place looks fucking prime up. for solar electricity. I probably should have put myself out there more, but it was better to be around in case the residents needed me. So you were free to come and go as you pleased? Yeah. Uh, why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Just being an overly invested sister. Curious how you spent your time. Thanks. I mean, I guess this conversation is supposed to feel awkward, considering we haven't seen each other, I think it's in like 10 years. <laughs> so, I guess that would explain. Allison. Yeah? That's very true, Candace. Whenever someone says, oh, nothing, after out. asking questions, it's not good. Okay, you need to promise not to freak out. Uh oh. What is it? Oh, Apple. What do you have? What is this? It's a gift. From Eddie. I know he's not your favorite person, but. I'm sorry. When you said Eddie, I thought you meant Chief Brown, as in the police officer who arrested me. Come on, Doc. Don't. And your adopted father, the man who didn't let you visit me for seven years. The Fireweed Administration backed him up, Tyler. They thought it was best for both of us. Yeah, well, it wasn't. It's a peace offering. And you're the two most important people in my oh life. Oh my god. Oh no. Please. For me. He can't buy my forgiveness with some cheap-ass trinket. It's a gift, Tyler. You know what gift giving means in Clinket culture. Oh, Clinket. What it means to refuse one. <sighs> Fine. I'll play along. Fine. I'll take it, but I'm not going to wear it. Really? Really. Just so we're clear, this was for you, not Chief Brown. You know, you could call him Eddie. Fat Eddie fucking chance, him. bitch. Uncle? Fat fucking chance, Hard bitch. Ass. You're pushing it with this fucking trinket. 
Oh, I'm okay. Whale breathing? Did you hear that? like home yeah god damn hope that whale don't fuck on us would it ruin the moment if i said i needed to call home uh yes completely damn sorry go ahead and stop apologizing all the time okay sorry <sighs> thanks all right well we'll go fuck around for a bit it's so weird being back on this boat <laughs> camera what? Okay, 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 okay. Now that I know how horrible the camera is, this camera is under my control now. Absolutely not. <laughs> oh my god. I was thinking about chucking it, but I'm like, fine. God. I already hate this vehicle. Get some cool impressive, shit. Oh yeah, real impressive. If you say so. I know some folks think an odd six is old and boring, and I've dropped loose from the thump with this one for years. Need that? Hunt? No. Never had the chance. No. Too bad. Ain't nothing like laying down the hammer on a big damn animal to make you feel alive. Can I curse this fucker out? Uh, Delos Crossing? Same here. You from around here? I'll be honest. Born and bred. Ah, uh, you don't say. I moved to Anchorage around your age. Dead? Delos was mostly Alaskan Native. Sir, you were in that staircase. I know. Sir, you were... <laughs> Sir, you were in that staircase. Oh, so you owed your family a visit? I'll say. Sir. You may not know it yet, but your folks, they get Sir. real fast. Sir. Right. I'm Alex, by the way. Alex Gershwin. No relation. Huh? To George Gershwin. Um. Gershwin, the pianist. I wouldn't folks fucking always know. always asking for related, so I try to head it off the pass. Oh. I'm sure. What'd you say your name was? Just call me Tyler. All right. Good to meet you, Tyler. Okay, well, Likewise, everyone's a cunt. Apparently. Hello, Miles. Okay. Could... Okay. I thought... Did I not turn... Okay, I turned it on. Why is it, like, grabbing... Is it because I have this up? Do I need to turn that down a bit? Hey, good to meet you. Just call me Tyler. <laughs> good to meet you. Just call me Tyler. Oh yeah, there's some nice accessibility settings here. Okay, I am not... Oh, I see. It's trying to turn around with me. Which is horrible. It needs to not do this. This camera is not... Not working with me. Okay. Hey again. Fancy meeting you here. There's nothing like the open air. Hey, you send your application to Denali yet? Uh, not yet. I need way more experience. You're not applying to There's run the entire pure. national park. They've got to have something entry level, right? Yeah, but I've done no internships, no volunteer work. They probably get hundreds of applicants. And Come I've on. Got nothing to show. Come on, you don't know that. Doesn't hurt to try. I'm trying to just yeah. look at that building. I watched the cell footage you sent me, but seeing it for real is wild. Yeah, it 
was terrible. Yeah, this landscape is very gorgeous. The over in this game is already Two pretty fucking later, beautiful. They haven't cleaned it up at all. The company went under after, and surprise, no one else is eager to take it on. Jesus. Someone died, right? Yeah. It was a crazy day. Sounds Wait, like it. Didn't we used to swim off that dock? Wait, no. That was on the way. Oh, uh, they pulled that one out. What? No. No. Man, so many good memories. Of pushing me into the lake? Yes. No, I'm taking responsibility for that. Sorry about that. Kids are dicks. Yes, well, I only accept apologies in the form of chocolate. Deal. This is a very long ferry ride, which I mean is fitting. What else can I do here? Are there other things I can look at? I mean, I thought I covered all the bases. Can I open this? Those are just life jackets. Can I pull a fire alarm? Oh. I guess I'm leaving. Goodbye, world. <laughs> I must return home. My planet needs me. Oh, okay, we were just magically... Okay. <laughs> Alright. I want you to drive your vehicles over rivers, and that contraption is asphalt reinforced by concrete. <laughs> How convenient. I mean, I'm glad it didn't just make me, like, sit there awkwardly and, like, wait for shit to happen. I have no idea how long this first episode is either, by the way. I'm assuming it's probably like an hour or two, kind of like how Life is Strange was. That's my assumption, anyways. The game is maxed out, by the way, on graphics, for those of you who weren't here earlier. Yeah, it's going to be quick if I'm not a completionist, and usually I don't spend too much time time uh, searching for collectibles, so. Maybe in the car company fjord. <laughs> All right, break it down. Bust that fucking fence. No, we don't even need to. Oh wait, I wouldn't touch that. You're in fucking Alaska. I'm sure that's probably pretty cold. God damn it. Of course you fucking nerds go to a wrestling reference. To be fair, though, as someone who is used to cold weather, at wow. some point you just wear less because you're just used to it. Exactly like I remember it. Only faded. Like a Polaroid left on a windowsill. Thanks. From the outside, it almost looks charming. Charm's not so the always more than this. Struck I mean, I usually end up wearing like sweatshirts in like 20 degree weather. You think there's a chance whoever buys it will just tear it down if someone buys it they can do whatever they want with it you wouldn't care at all would you sure i usually don't wear shorts but Everywhere a lot of the time i'll end up wearing like just jeans adventures. and like maybe a t-shirt and a sweatshirt everywhere i look i just see her allison we could go grab a bite start this tomorrow no the only way to get this done is to do it. Alrighty. After you. Oh, of course you fucking make me do it. Yeah, what happened to fucking let's do it? No, you know what? Fuck you. I'm out of here. This... Is it my stick? Like, what is it about this camera that just... Re Why? 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 Why do you do that? Why do you do that? I'm... 
Stop that. How did she get around on these roads with this thing? <laughs> Stop moving my camera for me, game. Spend money on a new one. Yeah, still waiting for those bikes she promised us. At least the shed's still standing. Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with that later. Plenty else to do first. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa, wait. Wait a minute. Something weird happened there. I, I, I like if I swap between the fucking mouse and shit. Okay, can I climb this? No. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I can't believe these are still here. Yeah. We should hide them so they don't frighten away potential buyers. Y yes, who's immediately as I started as I started the stream, two people came into my Remember chat and made the joke. <laughs> if we didn't use the compost. And she always knew when we were lying. Waste not or kiss the planet goodbye. I'm sorry, wait. Oh, lovely. Oh, the fucking Backstreet Boys joke. I bet we left all kinds of cool things in there. Can I go I in there? I bet we left all no. kinds of cool things in there. Alright, who's ready for a fucking- Stop moving my camera! Okay, wait. <laughs> what if I do this? Does that actually, like... No. It just makes it stronger. <laughs> Why? No, you're right. Yes, I did, but... Like, I, I, I get the game might be, like, trying to point me somewhere, but I'm trying huh? to just move around. It's like a neighbor came by. It's funny. I can't remember any signs of them when we were kids. Probably because our mother scared the shit out of them. Yeah. She scared everybody else off, too. You need a break already, Ronan? No, just sitting. Enjoying the view. Seriously, how are you feeling? Tired. I didn't sleep much last night. Yeah. I can't believe how we used to run around for That is still more forgivable than Rip not knowing the yeah. Jaw slide. Always a troll to run away from. Or a treasure to find. We definitely never lacked imagination. Marianne didn't either. It was the one thing that brought us all together. Even in the end. She told a new story, didn't she? That night? It was... Weird. She built this bench, right? If you're trying to scare me off so you can steal my seat, it won't work. No, I just... Remember us all sitting here after. I fell asleep and woke up really stiff later. I don't remember us sitting anywhere for more than a few seconds. Which sounds... Exhausting now. Guess we're just old. At least we've got a few more years before we're... Shit. As old as her. Alright, real quick. I got an alt tab out, and I'm gonna move this, like, up here. I thought maybe there'd be things in the upper left, but that's not the case. <laughs> Come on. That's enough rest for us. Let's get inside. Alright. Is it... Oh! Chat, you know why the camera's being weird? It's because I'm using the wrong duke. <laughs> I'm using the broken one. That's why this shit's being fucked up. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> oh my god. Son of a bitch. Apparently you noticed what you're complaining about. The camera was like moving with my other stick, which is the problem that that Duke has. Okay. Alright. Yes. Okay. So much better. <laughs> this camera's horseshit. I'm so glad I realized it before I, I was like hours into the game. Because holy shit. I would have felt so bad if I just shit on this game entirely because of a stupid controller issue I didn't realize I had. Or I'll just let me go. I'm gonna run on the lake. Damn it. I wish to explore. Oh, there's something over here. Um, no beavers. Too bad. 
picture of him would have helped with the sale. Yeah, city people love cute furry animals. Teeming with wildlife, but not the kind that eats the insulation. Situated comfortably in the ass of the world, solicitors will never come knocking. In fact, no one will ever come at all. Perfect. Yep. <laughs> yep. We should... Doesn't seem like the greenest oh, source of energy. Not like she had the money for solar panels. Time to Photoshop that shit for you. Hell yeah. Uh, did you smoke something before you left Fireweed? The door's right there. After I was just you? looking at the window, you bitch. Oh, it's locked. Locked. Well, it's a good thing I remember this. You sure that's the right key? Yes. Maybe someone changed the lock. Who would change the lock on us? I don't know. We're screwed. You got a plan B? Yeah. We find another way in. I never knew a locked door that could keep the crafty goblins out. So that's yeah. why... We had a million ways in and out of this old house. True, could be on the wrong lock. At least one of them's gotta work. Right, through the compost it is. So that's... How do I open that? How do I journal? Okay, I, is it just collectibles? Okay. Wait. The crafty goblins are two cunning little thieves who live under the princess's house. They're always getting into mischief, but they have good hearts. Okay, that's cute. I could break a window. You know civilized people don't do that, right? Oh, so we're civilized now? Oh, well, maybe not. But we are trying to sell this place, and broken windows aren't exactly... <sighs> the crafty goblins. I haven't thought about them in forever. <laughs> or should I say, us. We almost spent more time as goblins than we did as kids. Oh, Can we open this up now? All the other characters? No. The moon hag, the ice king, the old bear. Most of them. Think, but the details are fuzzy. Hey, do you know what happened to the book with all the stories? No, no idea. But I'm sure it'll turn up when we clean this place out. Okay, so like, I love a game that At has like natural conversation like that. Yep. Thought I could get in. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it though. Well, better alive than. Dead. I guess this is my fault for trying to. Exp yes. Oh wait, I'm Let's an idiot. Deal with that later. Can we get in here? Plenty else to do first. Damn it! Hey, it's locked, all right. You sure your key wasn't the fucking shed key? Does this window open? What was she doing out here that night? Oh no. Um, she did not like us using her tools. Well, at least the tools are still here. That'll help with the repairs. They're good quality too. Marianne wanted <sighs> stuff like that to last. I kinda wish the game would not let me look at other things Only while I'm listening to this because I don't mean to like interrupt not have the same shelf life. Oh, add it to the shop. I totally believe that the, it's the garage key and she just had the wrong key this whole time. Uh, okay, so we probably want to get into the shed, I imagine, is now our goal. Theoretically. Can I kick this in? No. I'm wasting time. Hey, it's locked, all right. That would be an Allison move. Can I climb the roof? No. Um, what about the back door? Damn it. Open sesame. Let me guess. It's locked. Yup. Know any other secret passwords? Hmm. Honeydew? Nope. Can I open this? Damn it. It's no good. I can't open this one either. It's okay. We'll find another way in. I'm gonna fucking get into this house, damn it. I just said you don't want to fuck Allison, but Allison sucks. For this right now. Luckily, remember the snowstorm in 2004? Marianne oh god, oh god, hours. am I stuck? Okay. I remember she made it a game, at least. That's right. We made tunnels to escape the ice troll. You gotta hand it to her. She can make us do anything if she turned it into a goblin tail. Tyler doesn't know how to climb slime rocks? 
I guess I don't know how to climb slime rocks either. Can I go in here now? Because this feels important. You really want to go out there? I guess not. No, you're right. Hmm. Yeah, too much Fall Guys in my brain. I was playing Fall Guys on PS4 with the boys earlier. And uh, I have the input delay issue on PS4, unfortunately. No, it should be fine. Okay. If we just get this board out of the way, I could probably squeeze through. I'm gonna splinter. So we need something to pry it off. <laughs> well, some good. people don't have it. Like Justin straight up just doesn't have it, and he has a normal PS4. So I don't know how the fuck I think that I works. Saw one back in the shed. Let's go check. Did I real? Okay, game. I love you. Did I really have to like? Go activate that just to get over here. Hey, it's locked, all right. <sighs> I just got an achievement for what? For trying to unlock something three times? Oh, free? <laughs> Actually, yes. <laughs> okay. There should be something in here that'll work. Okay, but this doesn't. I guess Marianne left us something useful, huh? Yeah. We still have to find a way to get inside, though. And okay. please, no broken windows. We'll see ya. What's happening? What? Do you feel that? What? 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 Okay. Don't leave this room until everything looks as clean as a whistle. Ugh. This is the millionth uh... time I've gotten in trouble because of you. You and your big mouth. Hey, you were thinking the same thing. You just weren't brave enough to tell her. What good would it do? It's not like she ever listens to us anyway. Well, I'd rather scream it right in her stupid face than be a quiet little mouse. Fuck yeah, Tyler. Oh, Get in there. We forgot the key. We need to put it back. Maybe we could hide it somewhere. You know, for fun. Goblins are supposed to help the princess. Not for Does she see this too, or are we fucking crazy? I'm only trying not to make her even worse. Whoa. Did that just happen? I don't know. But I saw it too. Oh, so she did like see it too. We used to share thoughts with our voice. It did, but that was a memory of us ten years ago, right? I, I vaguely remember it. Those are mutually exclusive. Right. Yeah, that's fair. And uh, that's new, right? Yeah. We could share thoughts and feelings, but we never replayed memories like that. Why We're taking we this it? awfully pretty well, honestly. And why that memory? I don't know. It's pretty eerie. We're, we're taking this fairly well for this Weird. being our first time visually replaying a memory that we've had. I'm feeling something again. Near the barn. Oh. Yeah, me too. Double O? Do you remember? See the silent frog coming and coming. What? Stop sulking. I told you already. I'm sorry. No, you're not. Okay. Guess you don't want to see what I put in the treasure room then. What? No, I want to see. Okay. I guess we know where to search now. We just have to remember which one is the silent. Why am I so frog? Why am I so muffled? Damn. Where is the key? Seriously? Kidding. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay, sorry. That's I true. Don't nod is usually pretty quite nonchalant. I think the only person who, like, really... At least the shed's well, I say that. Yeah. God damn it. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with that later. Okay. So... Take that. Huh. Yeah, better alive than dead. Better alive than dead. Better alive than dead. It wasn't me. Has someone been out here? Wasn't me. Got it. All this for a screwdriver? You got a better idea how to get in? I want to take the pliers too. I just wanted to steal shit. I want to go in the barn. Damn it. Ramsey, I swear to God. Oh, we screwed those in? 
Okay, I thought they were nails, but apparently we just all ass screwed them in. You know, you could have just unscrewed the other two bits. <laughs> you sure you want to go in there? This was our very first den, remember? He said screwed earlier. Oh, well, that was my fault then for not paying attention to details. Got him. <laughs> then why am I laughing? Okay, fine. But you're still an idiot. All right. I'm going in for real this time. Got okay. him. She is See such a pain. Front door in a few minutes. Truthfully. Allison has like no spine. Stealth level. Let's fucking go. Crouch. Hold on. What do we got over here? Fuck all. Okay. Crouch. Oh, fucking, okay. <laughs> just just put your head through the ceiling. Tyler, you... Tyler, honey. Oh, are we speaking through telepathy? Oh, we, we, can, we can telepathy. I don't suppose you remember how to get to the hatch. I think so. Okay, well, I don't know. We'll figure it out together. I say, didn't crouch well for shit. Right, straight ahead. Need to go left, I think. <laughs> okay, but fuck you. You were right. Nothing here. Of course I was. I, nothing here? There's a fucking collectible. Eat shit, Tyler. Don't tell me there was nothing here. Oh fuck. Not even in your dreams. Can't oh right. Delos crossing, Olympic event, rock skipping, Allison four, oh oh. Ollie three. Unfortunate. I'm telling Tyler to eat shit. I'm sorry, but Tyler Tyler was just like, there's nothing here, but there was something there. Left again after the goblins. Left again after the goblins? Well, I think there's more collectibles. It was on the right. My oh, bad. Oh, well, she was wrong. Well, now I gotta go left. Wow. Can't say I ever expected to see you again. It's been a long time, buddy. It's been a while. Why am I just staring into your asshole? I was gonna say, that's an insanely good shape. Aww. Wait, that was our treasure? It's just trash. We could make treasure out of anything. Our imaginations were that powerful. Pink. It always had to be pink. Marianne grilled us about all these missing dishes, but a goblin never gives up their treasure. So it's Alnalore. God damn it, Fudge Cycle. Pass the treasure. Straight ahead. That's the... I almost convinced myself our voice was just another childhood fantasy. Me too. But we... Mad Hunter. Why am I still afraid to say his name? He was Mary Ann's creation. Uh -huh. She made all the creepy characters. Wait, where am I going now? Oh, wait, wait. Oh, okay. Open up. I'll snore. I'm in. John has like some fucking pretty ass eyes, I just want to say. Like truthfully, I can't get over it. Tyler and me like share eyes and I, I can't handle it. Oh, this is cute. Yeah, don't let her in. Fuck Allison. Colonel. Huh. Huh. 
Colonel, I'm in your house. I found the secret hatch. Tyler, are you in there? I've infiltrated the main compound, proceeding to destroy the Shagod. Tyler! Nah, bitch. Coming. Are you okay? I'll live. Good to hear your voice again. Yeah. Same here. So, coming in or what? Just working up to it. Well, we're here. <laughs> Here we are. So, how do we get started? Well, figure out what to keep, what to trash, and see what else this house might be trying to show us. Alrighty. All right. Let's see. Broken shelf, broken jar, and the washing machine. Broken. broken. The dryer never worked to begin with. To me, I thought dryers were straight up evil. But I'd be wrong. I hated hanging drippy laundry. I refused to change for a few weeks once, so I wouldn't have to do it. Damn. Uh, anything else in here? Does not appear so. I don't. I don't mean to spin in a circle. That's just what happens. Mary, answer him. Agreed. Okay, then. Ooh, this place needs some serious cleaning. We should take down the creepy masks if we don't want to scare the buyers away. Oh, so now you don't want to scare someone with those masks. Are these authentic? Are these authentic blankets? I doubt it. I'm surprised Marianne would buy fakes. 20 years ago, everyone was buying fakes. Huh. This bathroom still smells like Marianne. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't I don't like that sentence. I tried to bury this dress in the backyard, but Marianne caught me. You need a pretty dress. Yeah, well, we both know pretty was never my thing. Honey, what are you talking about? You look amazing. What are we gonna do with all her jewelry? Well I'm certainly not. I assume Marianne is the donation mother. pile it is then. There are so many times I looked in this mirror hoping somehow it'd show me something different. Uh -huh. Wow. Uh -huh. I forgot all about her. Must not be a good mom. I mean, she tried to murder him. So. We were lab rats. Handmade soap. Still here after ten years. Impressive. You could say that about the entire house. I mean, if my mother literally tried to kill me, I probably wouldn't to refer to her as my mother. I feel like that's a. I feel like. I feel like I probably would also. Aww. We were so competitive about who measured taller, like we actually had anything to do with it. And after all that, it ended in a tie. Yeah, none of that crazy stretching I did made any difference. Unfortunate. I'm guessing you're gatekeeping the way upstairs for now. Guess we never had time to complete the collection. These came out of one of the prize machines at the Becky store, right? Yeah. You'd slide the quarters inside on the little tray, and then magic, out pops a sticker. Damn. Nut. Good old nut to guess the dog. Never had time to complete the collection. Tyler, please, please do not repeat yourself. Oh my god. Store, right? Yeah. You'd slide the quarters inside on the little tray, and then magic, out Whoa, pops a sticker. Whoa, what the fuck? I was gonna say, I felt those controller vibrations. Mom? About me joining the hockey team? Mom! Sorry, what? Uh, not now. Maybe next year. But you promised! Keep whining, and my next year will become never. Can you cut my hair? Your hair is fine. But I want to cut it short, really short. What? Look, I'm tired, and I'm busy. Let's talk about this later. You always say that. Well... Marianne said no to everything. 
made me so pissed. She was always on edge those last few months. Yeah, and completely deaf to everything I was telling her I needed. She pretty much I was gonna say, that was just depressing. To. True, but it felt personal with me. She was trying to save the planet way before Al Gore made it cool. Has Al Gore ever made anything cool? Nah. I guess she was right about one thing, but you can't really blame anyone for not listening to crazy Marianne Ronan. I didn't realize how much I missed the smell of firewood. I miss the cold winter nights curled up here. <laughs> Al Gore made the internet cocoa. cold. Yeah. God Marianne damn. was so tired she was usually asleep on the couch. Oh my ah, Jesus Christ, there's a lot going on here. We'd use our voice so we didn't wake her up. And then we'd be up all night telling stories and watching the fire. <laughs> Shitting on Elgor, what a game. <laughs> Life is quite strange. She took so many pictures. Yeah. Like she had to document every second of our lives. I mean, that's usually what parents do. It made her happy. And it was kind of nice to see her smile. Oh my god. You almost okay? fell over. All these happy pictures. <laughs> Albert resents that. You look so sad now. So staged. I know. Wow. I'm so embarrassed for us. Mini Da Vinci's, we were not. She saved every drawing we ever did. There's a couple of That's these I keep. Is that all I can look at here? Okay. Don't fall over, what the fuck? I'm sorry. Oh, uh, what do we got here? I don't remember these. Birds. Probably one of Marianne's unfinished Oh, God, is it? Oh, I thought they were pigeons for a second and I had a fight or flight reaction. In some weird way that only made sense to Marianne. Oh, okay. I, I'm like, what is that flapping? It's our fucking jacket. <laughs> she pinched every penny. You do what you gotta do. Oh no. No, we broke a vase. <laughs> we're, we're assholes of children. Hey mom, we are sorry the vase got broke. We didn't know you love it so much. We need to be careful and not act up in the window room. Next time we will try and use good judgment. Please forgive us for doing bad things. I'm sorry too. We should be more careful. I'm very sad we made you cry so much. We should play outside instead. I will tell Ollie not to be wild all the time. We aren't going to do it anymore. We are sorry. Damn. Yeah, who's Ollie? What are you reading? A letter we wrote her. Is tall is Ollie breaking that stupid The other name? Remember? For your kids into good behavior. Great parenting strategy. Or is Ollie a dog? No, because... No. Old textbooks. Tessa gave them to us, right? Yeah. She thought we were gifted. I always loved when she came over. She brought food and toys. Oh, when you're probably right, Fl like you're, you're probably right, Fletch. Why do you say that? Her worldview is... narrow. As I say, I feel like that's a hard, like, that feels like the dead name. Otherwise, Allison just had a really good friend outside of... I was gonna say, they could also just be fucking well since it's actually a dog. But can a dog do stone skipping contests? Because there was the counter. Of course. Fix the window. What's that hey, one? She drew some little hearts here. Oh. What? Mars 7. Oh. Hey, that reminds me. I owe you like 10 birthday gifts. I think we can let that slide. I was gonna say, the calendar hasn't changed in 10 years. Shit. I mean it. Hey, you being back is the only gift I need. Aw. Aw. The last few months are almost all blank. Only a few appointments. Most of them canceled. What kind of appointments? Hairdressing, I think. Oh yeah. She did that for a while. Uh, me too, but don't write here. Aww. It's cute as shit. Zero 4 p.m. canceled. Canceled. 
the last few months are oh, almost they're... all blank. <laughs> Only a few appointments. Only a few appointments. Most of them canceled. Most of them canceled. Of Hairdressing. Oh, I can't go past oh, yeah. March. She did that for a while. 2005 was a year. I don't remember a lot from it. Best mom. You think we ever really believed that? Or were we just trying to make her happy? Either way, it wasn't true. <laughs> Fuck. Sponsored by the local goblins. That's cute. That's cute as shit. String, glue, duct tape. The holy trinity of house repair. Marianne loved having something to fix. But not the part where it got broken. Especially if we were the ones responsible. I know. I'm just saying she liked to save broken things. <laughs> I wasn't fighting with you, Allison. I was simply making a joke. I was making a funny about how we she were troublesome children. She used to barter for our clothes with homemade jam. She tried everything to make ends meet. <laughs> well, not everything. I wonder if she ever met Matt Hardy. Let's go upstairs. See what we got. Hold on, I gotta see these these legs. Are we are we working with? Oh, we're working with actual legs. Damn it. Aw, this is fucking cute. It's cute as shit. Oh shit, we got a view. Oh shit, we got a view. Yo, what are you doing down there? What do you think I'm doing? Trying to figure out if anything in Marianne's mess is worth keeping. Any progress? Not really. What about you? Coming past some hurts is a mistake we made this year. You're not wrong. Uh, you know, just plotting world domination. Ah, it's a big responsibility. Not sure if you can hack it, Ronan. <laughs> oh, ye of little faith. I guess it is about time to check our bedroom. I'll be up in a second. Okay, hon. Whatever. Ronan wondered his sweeter name than Tyler. I mean, Ronan's just their last name, so... They just get a cool last name. Waiting on you, bitch. It's fucking good. Oh, okay. Maybe that. Maybe the walk cycle wasn't as good as I thought it was. Now this... This feels like home. Oh my... Oh my god. Oh, wow. How did you convince me to let you put this up? It was my favorite movie. Back then. Everyone with big ass rooms. So much for my dream of being a hockey star. Marianne thought sports were too aggressive, too competitive, and too group thinky. Group thinky? Group thinky? <laughs> hey, the postcard we sent ourselves from Juno. Forever alone. What? We barely had any friends. We even had to be our own pen pals. Damn. Oh, fuck. Okay. He hello, Allison and Ollie. We are writing from the past. What is it like in the future? Anyway, you know, it's super cool. We took the tramway all the way up. Ollie was scared. Liar. Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> that was our, our our writing. We got some books. My mommy went to the restaurant at night and forgot them. It was cool. There were a lot of whales on the ferry. No, there wasn't any... No, there wasn't. They were in the water. Stupid. Anyway, here's a postcard to remind you of how awesome we are, especially me. A and O, Allison and Ollie Ronan, 12 Canary Road, Davos Crossing, AK 774 Oh, mommy. Fuck. I feel like I should stop reading the dead name as the dead name. I probably shouldn't do that now that I'm thinking about it. Whenever we asked for a TV, she'd just bring home a big stack of books. I think she did us a favor with that one. Mm, you may not agree when we start digging into the HBO back catalog. We'll see. Oh no. Ugh. Some of our old toys give me the creeps. That's fucking terrifying. That's absolutely horrifying. Oh my god. It's a fucking makeshift dragon head on a goddamn stick. Is that a stick? I think it's a stick. It's fucking terrifying. Tyler, do you copy? If we don't move fast, this whole thing is going to melt. Do you copy? Copy, Allison. Gonna get this thing moving soon. Don't want the Mad Hunter to catch us. Over. 
the mad hunter. Ugh, he still gives me the creeps. I wish I could forget about him. Look what I found. What? Only our greatest creation, the Book of Goblins. <laughs> Seriously? It was in that chest the whole time? All these stories. <laughs> I had to yeah, look I at my controller to remember what the fucking Mary button Ann that was. Yeah. It's one of the only times I remember her being Oh my at peace. god, no. Is it, there's... Oh my god, there's so many stories. Oh my god, no. I'm not reading all of these. Holy shit, there's so many. I'm not reading these. Well, I mean, I can always do this. So, like, it, it'll it'll give us a better reading, but I'm not... Okay, well, at least they also have, like, a way to, like, read this if you ever want to. Uh, where is it? This guy skips 45 minutes of story essential content. My diary. You never told me about it. Yeah. With the way Marianne was, I tried extra hard to keep it a secret. Marianne. Yeah, that day she found out about it. Uh-oh. Oh no. Mom. Um. Um. Mom. Um. I know about the release schedule. What do you mean? For tell me why? Isn't it like Mom, once every month? Or... What did you do with it? What now? I can't find my diary. I know you stole it. Give it back, sweetie. Whatever I do, it's just for your benefit. You read it, didn't you? You had no right to do that. Oh, I have the right no. to do whatever I need to protect my little girl. Oh girl. no. You. you will always be my little girl. No. No matter how no. hard you fight me, I'll fight twice as hard. No. As Released weekly? <laughs> oh my god, honey. Honey, I'm so sorry. Well, I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this a weekly thing, but I'll definitely try to. Oh, I never saw it coming. Okay. She told me right to my face. She was willing to hurt me to keep me from transitioning. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god, Tyler, I'm so sorry. There is no way you could have known she'd go that far. I don't think that was Tyler's point, Allison. I want my diary back. We're gonna find your fucking diary. Place I didn't look. We're gonna find your fucking diary, Tyler. Okay, but do you need to get it like now? That's good, Red. That I love you, buddy. Important to me, Allison. Writing down my thoughts helped me realize who I am. We're getting your fucking diary back. We're doing this. Well, then let's go find it. You think her room is still locked? It always was. Oh, oh. Happy memories, please. Can we have a happy memory here? Caught the hag. His furious voice could be heard throughout the forest. For your wickedness, you will be eternally bound to the lake. What? No way. Quiet, let me finish. You will no longer be allowed to leave. Not even under a full moon. The moon hag was in I was gonna say, I'll break lake. down that fucking door. She We're getting that diary again. back. Tried to escape. Hmm. And then the title. What do you think? Not bad, right? Uh, I guess that's okay. But I would have changed the end. What? No way! <laughs> wow! Just totally fucked on her. That's because it was dangerous to mention his name. He was too proud. <laughs> Absolutely just fucked on her. Alright. Here we go. Hold up. What? We gotta sell the house. Uh, unfortunately. You must solve my riddle to earn the right to enter the princess's sanctum. Nothing a good hard shove won't take care of. I mean, yes, we could brute force it, but it might be kind of fun to finally solve it. Oh my god. Right? For real game? Of the word fun. Okay, well, if we break it, we're just gonna have to fix it for the sale. So let's at least try not to. You have the Book of Goblins? 
Yep. No. Hey, no. Lord. No. No. Do not tell me. I have to read those what stories. The image on the door is making me think of a story from the Do book. not tell me. I have to read through the stories. You have a way better memory than me. No, please, game. Well, I'm begging you. my creation. And you'll never let anyone forget it. I'm begging you. Do not. Here it is. The one about the princess's party. Okay. Okay, the game's... It seems like it's helping me through this. Give it a read. I think the symbols may represent something in the story. Okay. The game's at least telling me First which story I have to read here. Now storybook puzzles. Or it just told day. me to fuck off. What a weird childhood. Touche. Okay. Okay. What was it? Princess's Party, I think is what it was. Okay. Wait, hold on. Let me just see if there's any symbols. Wait, am I still on the Princess's Party? Oh, yeah, no. It's... Okay, Princess's Party is two pages. Okay. Okay, so... Once upon a time, in a deep and ancient forest, the princess was melancholy, because it was the one-year anniversary of when she had run from home. Sensing her sadness, her forest friends showed up at her door. They were headed by the pelican, pious and attentive, and organized by the moose, stalwart and far-sighted. The old bear was there with his claws so sharp, as well as the big frog, prattling away, even the haughty muskrat who mostly came out at night had come. The bear invited her to ride on his back, promising no wolf would harry her path. And then the animals would lead her to a fairy glen, where a fabulous party had been prepared. It was a buffet of seafood the pelican had served from her never-emptying beak. The air was filled with wink winking fairy lights the moose had arranged after clouds filled the sky. And the gregarious frog mixed up fizzing drinks. Only the muskrat had done nothing in particular, mooching off everyone else's hard work princess had a good, very good time at her party. Such a good time that she forgot to say thank you to any of her friends. Noticing this, the fairies devised a bit of mischief. When the princess went to open her gifts, she found three identical boxes at the edge of the glen. Puzzled, she turned back and gasped. The entire party had vanished. Because you have taken your friends for granted, called the naughty fairies, we have hidden them from you. But we like games. Guess who has given you each of these presents, and you'll get your friends back. The princess who opened the princess opened the first box. Inside there was a torch, which, when lit, revealed the truth. Hmm, said the princess. Someone wants to make sure I don't get lost in the woods when it's dark. And that I always see you right from wrong. Which of my friends would give me a gift like that? She opened the second box. Inside there was a magic sword, which would leap right out of the bear's hands to defend them. Hmm. Said the princess, someone wants to make sure I'm protected if I'm ever under threat. Which of my friends would give me a gift like that? She opened the third box. Inside, there was a bag of coins that always provided money. If it was for something, the bear surely needed. Hmm, said the princess. Someone wants to make sure I have money to buy food when I am hungry, and clothes when I am cold. Which of my friends would give me a gift like that? Sorry. The princess thought about her friends, and then she smiled certainly. Fairies, she said, I may have been through I may have been thoughtless, but I appreciate all that my friends have given to me, and that they have and all that they have done for me. She gave her answers, and the vexed fairies were forced to restore the party in a flash of colorful light. One by one she gave the animals a hug and thanked them for the presence, the party, and all they had done to help since she'd moved into the forest. And that is how the princess celebrated her first anniversary in the woods. I have to guess which, okay, I have to guess which of these animals would have given her what. That's what I'm getting here, okay. So, okay, what, oh, right, okay, so the first gift is the torch of that gives me light or whatever so maybe you have to use sword to steal money from someone so you can even buy a torch okay so as far as light goes i feel like that would be the pelican because the pelican wants you to be attentive and aware of your surroundings 
Or maybe it was the moose? Star Wars and Farsighted? I don't think... I don't... The sword has to be the bear, right? Like, the, the sword, I feel like, is the bear. Like, that, that, that feels correct in my head. Let me give it a shot first before I ask for help. If I can't get it, then I will ask. There's a buffet. Um, I'm very confident about any solutions. Promising no wolf would harry her path. Um, I feel like the pelican would give in her money because of his never-ending beak. So then the moose? Yeah, there we go. See, I'm not completely an idiot. How the fuck did she set that up with her door? And boom, we're in. Same way they set up to work in Skyrim, duh. After so many shit. years, Fair enough. I expected this to feel more, you know, like a win. Well, I mean, we're kind of un in here yourself. under, uh... I'm the one who solved the riddle. Damn right. Why do I feel like you're not gonna let me forget that? Where do How you did that have power? Working? I don't know. Where in this mess would she stash someone else's personal thoughts? Uh, dresser? Because Allison, you're a bitch. Got it. It's here. This bitch scratched out. Oh I my knew god. It. I fucking knew it. Do you think she read it? Of course. She was nosy as hell. Honey, I know, like, I was expecting it to be, like, a little more difficult or a little more well-hidden, but. Eh? Eh? Hold on. Is this not what we don't, is this not what we think it is? Is this game going to subvert expectations? Tyler. Tyler. What? Look. Is this game going to fuck on me now? What? Where did you find that? It was on her desk with her papers. Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, we gotta be really careful not to overthink this. But it doesn't make any sense. What's she, going on she here? She was mad, right? I was gonna say, y'all remember that literally I, vividly. I cut my hair. She attacked me because I cut my hair. She was mad and she attacked you. We both saw it. Then what is this shit? I was gonna say, something doesn't make know. sense here. Something's up. Tyler, What's going on? Come here. What did you say? You can't do this to me. Not now. When I've finally made sense of a few things. Well, that was your first mistake. Thinking the world made any kind of sense. Okay. Okay. Um. Ten years in the grave. And she's still finding new ways to piss us off. Yeah. What the fuck? I think I need some air. Oh, honey.
Alright, you got me, game. I'm hooked. I'm in. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> That's true. We don't know what's in there. It could be a completely transphobic book. <laughs> Are you really, really sure? Oh? I am. Do it. Oh god, no. We're, oh no. I am not- I am not now playing through the night. Hey. Here we go. <laughs> Watch what you're doing, them fucking scissors. Hell yeah. Is it all gone? Yeah. I was gonna say, there's some fucking It looks amazing. Here. Hell yes. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to show mom. Oh god. She's been so sad lately. Aww. More than sad. She's been scary. Yeah, but not tonight though. It was almost like a party. Aww. Thank you, Allison. You don't have to thank me. Aww. You're my sister. I feel more like... Like your brother. Aww. Brother, sister. We look out for each other. Aww. But I'm um, pretty sure I just gave you a really bad haircut. <laughs> uh -huh. That's true, Mom? they did it on the bed. Why? Mom! Oh no. Oh, I don't like this. This lighting is implying very horrible things. Oh no. Oh no. Don't make me go through this. Don't make me do this. Don't nod. I need you to work with me. Do not make me do this. Do. No. No. Do not. Oh god. Oh god. Please tell me that was it. I don't want to go through more of that. Please don't. Please don't. Okay. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. It's okay. We're safe. I was gonna say, there's more to that than just transphobia. There's... there's something else there. Glad we found yeah, there's some trauma there. Me too. I guess she was trying to figure out where you were at. Yeah, well, she should have asked. I wasn't some goddamn research project. I was her child. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> About the book. Raising your transgender child? Do you even know how rare these books were in 2005? You know, that's a very solid point. Video game. Trying to figure out how to support me? Maybe. But she, she wasn't trying. She never... It doesn't make sense. I know. You cutting your hair oh was what God. set her off, right? Allison, she read my diary. She already knew. It wasn't my hair. And if we were wrong about that... Fuck. You think she read it. It's possible she never even opened She scratched diary, out the name! Exactly like we always thought they were. But if she did, and they aren't... God, Tyler. Sure. I mean, we could have been wrong. But what good does it do to ask the question now? You mean other than not having to live with the thought that my mom tried to kill me for being me? 
Tyler, I know you want there to be something to find. Something that'll make it all make sense. But she was unhinged. So that's it then. She was crazy. Nothing else to say. I think we'd be better off if we tried to move on. But Why fuck you. How about I want to get some See closure, Allison? People don't want to yeah, I don't understand what Allison's deal is here. They pretend like that night never happened. <laughs> what about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend. Let's ask her about it. Sure. But I'll warn you, she's particularly touchy about I this. wanted to give her shit, but I'm like, that's not important right now. I was always her favorite. Operative word was. But we need to go by the store anyway. To get a few things for the repairs. Great. Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread. I'm not sure I like that analogy. Listen, I know you don't want to keep talking about this. But you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. So let's talk. You've been on edge all day. Is there something more going on with you? It's nothing. Pretty sure it's not nothing. That doesn't mean shit, bitch. Like you can't use that anymore. Page. I thought we were on the same page. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. And then we found the book and things changed. You really don't get that? It's just with the way you avoided this place for the last three years, I thought you wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. So that's what this is about. Maybe a little. Yeah. It's just... You graduated three years ago. And this is the first time we've seen each other in person. I wasn't fucking ready, it's bitch. that I didn't want to see you. I just... Wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your fireweed graduation. I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. But you shut me out. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. <sighs> Alright, bitch, I'll play it. Look, I didn't want to see anyone. I just started testosterone. And, oh god. I had the worst acne. My emotions were all over the place, and the smells... Allison, the smells... Men smell bad. I know. I've dated a few. Look, I needed some time to figure my shit out before I asked anyone else to try. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, it does. So... I was thinking... Yeah, she really likes to bring it up. we need to be in such a rush to sell this place? We've been over this. And we both agreed it's time for a clean break. I know. Trust me. I'm not talking about staying for long. Just long enough to get some answers. And you think this house has those answers? Maybe not, but it's a place to start. <sighs> well, it would be a shame if there was something to find and we tossed it out. How about we start digging without putting off the sale? And if it seems like we need more time, we'll talk about it then. Okay. So, we have a plan? Yep. We ask around about Maryam, but we also stick to our repair schedule. If that's really what you need. All right. Deal. Molly's diary. It's been a long time since I heard that name. Was I the only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed for a while, until I settled on Tyler. Oh, maybe her mother didn't dr cross that out and that said... Know. What do you mean? I had a mentee who refused to call me Tyler. He didn't want my help. He didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. I like the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. Oh, this is going to be really sad, isn't it? Mom and Allison argued again. At least I'm not the only one Mom is screaming at now. I almost seemed jealous we didn't tell her what we were planning to do in the forest. Allie thinks we should tell her about our voice. I think she knows already. Mom seemed really upset when I asked to join the hockey team. Like it's wrong for me to play a boys sport. I'm going to keep asking. I'll try again next week. She said no again. 
so mad at her. Why does she always say no? Why doesn't she ever let me do what I want to do? Allison and I started writing a story. Well, Allison did. She didn't like it when I tried to change anything. Why can't one of the goblins be a boy goblin? Oh, this is gonna be really sad. Yeah, it was pre Tyler name. The the actual dead it's Yeah, it's play off of the dead name, I guess. Saw Star Wars yesterday at Bobby's place. Luke was so great. The mom found out we watched it and got so mad. She said a gloried war. <laughs> zum zum. Saturday, 5th of February, 2005. Well, Mom, would Mom be happier if I could do what she wanted me to do? She looks at me. She doesn't see me. I wish I could show her. I wish I could make her understand. I think she doesn't want to. Allison told me again that it was my fault Mom got angry at us. She's such a suck-up. Mom's barely said anything to us in a few days. Allie says she saw her throwing away pages from the Book of Goblins. Do this. Do that. I am sick of her voice. I am sick of that dumb name, too. I'm Ollie the Goblin. What? Nice ring. Get from your boyfriend? Come on. I told you I'm not with anyone right now. Don't rub it in. Why does it look familiar? It was a gift from Eddie. He had them both made at the same time. Both? Oh, wait. Yeah. This ring is supposed to be linked to the one he gave you, in a spiritual way. Do you believe in all that? You mean, do I believe we could be linked in some other metaphysical way? You know, other than the one that already lets us share thoughts and memories. I mean, that's fair, fair enough. Not a bad view, right? I forgot how beautiful it is. Remember that time we tried to cross the lake after it froze over? Oh yeah, how can I forget? Marianne lectured us for an hour. Well, she wasn't wrong at least. It was really dangerous. If we'd fallen in, no more goblins. We grew up on this lake. We know how to spot thin ice. I'm confused. Okay, this is, this is confusing. Wouldn't she be the one who would try to talk me out of it? Not okay. I'm I'm all sorts of lost. <laughs> I think I'd like to end up somewhere like this, just not here. Somewhere with more trees than people? Exactly. <laughs> just go into it with a little more of a plan than Marianne did. Already working on it. With my degree, it'll be easy to get a job as a ranger. After you spend a little time in Juno? Uh still a maybe on that one. <sighs> Alright. I think that's enough time enjoying the view. I wasn't gonna say anything, but... Yeah, yeah, I know. I was the one all eager to go, and then I started waxing poetic about the landscape. Go ahead. I know. I'll catch up. Need to respond to a message. Uh -huh. My sister, the social butterfly. It'd be easy to get a job as a ranger to tell people like that. Hello, Jeremy. Seems we got a trespasser. <laughs> Excuse me. You got five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Your property? Five. Four. I'm Tyler. No, no, any Tyler's. Three. Two. Sam. Ellie? What are you doing out here, girl? What the this fuck? Is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler. My brother. Are you brother? Oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but... Uh, oh, never. my fucking God. Damn. <laughs> you look like a real man. I'll fight you. So do you, Sam. You know what I mean. I just didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. Did you shut your fucking mouth, Sam? Bitch. Not a woman who looks like a man, Sam. A man. A real man, just like you. Oh, shit. 
Guess I'm the asshole again. You are. You gotta excuse us, old guys. I really don't. I was gonna say, no, I don't. You kids keep changing the rules. You can't expect us to keep up. Just keep up, bitch. The people are who they say they are. It's not hard. No, it ain't hard, but it just takes some getting used to. We'll get used to it, because we aren't going anywhere. That's right, bitch. So <laughs> yeah, literally. Okay, boomer. Exactly. Oh, well, I, uh, I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? Like patching the roof, checking the pipes, you know, all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, that's no big deal. I just, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. Bet, 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 bitch? You want to go? Didn't you used to help Mary Ann with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mama never had a man around, I just I took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. I think I think Sam was in. Uh, Sam seems like he was into Marianne. Uh, yeah, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place. That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks. Oh yeah, absolutely. But uh, selling your mother's house. Are you yeah. Sure? Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. Well, they're not gonna keep making payments. I want to ask you. Funny. Don't remember asking for your opinion on the subject. Tyler! What? What? What Tyler means is, a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. Yeah. This place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. But maybe some good ones, too? Sam, would you fuck off? Allie, can you hear me? Ty, you can't do this when we're in the middle of talking to someone. But this ben? is pointless. He's hammered. He's always hammered. And who knows? Maybe it'll make him chatty. Now come on. People think our family is weird enough. Um... Everything okay with you two? Yes. No. Oh. All right. <laughs> okay. How well did you know her? I'll engage in conversation well with I the dipshit. Well, I heard what happened that night. Well. Figured people <laughs> my shoulder several times in the past couple of hours. Oh, it really surprised. It's not good. Didn't. Much as anything ever has. That's too nice. I am too nice. Other folks say they saw it coming. The fuck does that mean? Not me. The fuck does that mean? The fuck does that mean? Did you help with her door? Her door? The puzzle on her bedroom door. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. You two kept sneaking in, giving her no privacy, huh? Want some lightning so far? Jesus. You solve it? Yep. Better late than never, I guess. Uh, never solved it myself. Uh, I mean, not that I wanted to. I, I, uh... uh, uh so, uh, guess you know all your mama's secrets now, huh? Well... She may have one or two left. We should go. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? I mean, yeah, I have no more dialogue options. Alright, well, let me see. Do I actually have more on dialogue options? Hmm. I guess I could ask him a few more questions. No, okay. I, I don't have more dialogue options. We should get going. <laughs> That's all you think we'll get out of him? Yes, game. I literally I've exhausted my options. He's too wasted to be of any more help. I'll tell him to get a move on then. 
Well, we've got a supply run to make, and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so. Right. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Uh, yeah, there was five going, of each, too. so. Um, Sam, we all got to get going. Oh, uh, of course. Of course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I, lots of to-dos on old Sam's list. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. Happy to do it. I... Uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? Sam? Huh? Sam. Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys? Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah, they're, they're yours. I, uh, You're damn right they are. This uh, is our fucking house. This place it meant a lot to your mother. I'm aware. It almost felt like you know, it was a part of her. And it's like some part of her is alive here still. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Jesus. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, uh, Tyler has no chill. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Tyler, I love you. <laughs> Hey, so, we really do have a lot to do. <laughs> no fucking chill. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. Goddamn. I was gonna say, I identify heavily with Tyler. Is that where this episode ends? There's more? There's more? I was hoping to knock this out in one night. But if there's more- Fuck, there's a whole other area! Shit! I wanted to knock this out in one night! Is there only three episodes? So far? Oh damn, my dude's got gauges. That might be our Michael. Ready to Veni Vidi Vecchi? The fuck did you just I'm say to me? Talk to Tessa. Just try to keep in mind that your memory of her is ten years out of date. Yeah, well, it wouldn't be if she reached out to me while I was in Fireweed, which she didn't. So I'm guessing this is Michael? What? What? Why are we playing as Allison now? I don't like this. Hold on. Okay, real quick though. In actuality, hold on. I need to go pull my eyes out because I had my contacts in all day from when I went out to eat. So, um...